Is that Kevin? Okay. Okay. Grab that one. And this one will balance you out. Okay. Do you have any starter? No. Okay, I'll have to get some. I've been cooking for probably 30 years. We started the organization last year. I'm going to make my own something. Just a group of guys that uh, around that like to cook. It doesn't take that long to become experienced at uh, Dutch oven cooking. It really is, the art is learning how to, to heat the oven. And uh, it's fairly simple. Uh, if you remember a simple rule of three up, three down, each of the ovens show a, a, a diameter, and you take that diameter, put three additional on top, three less on the bottom, and you have a three, 325, 350 degree oven. So once you learn uh, the temperatures, then it's just a matter of cooking uh, just like you would in the oven, or on top of the stove, uh, same principle. They're completely flame resistant, you ready? So if they caught on fire, then they wouldn't. So pick it up, and turn it about like that. Get about a quarter turn, now take this, and you turn the lid about a quarter turn the other direction, opposite of the way you went. You ready? Ready. So push it, or just you can just shove it like this one. Just shove it around to about there. Good. Now make sure you keep your heat on, and then another five minutes, you do another quarter turn, and that makes sure your heat stays even. When Lewis and Clark uh, expedition, they had the Dutch oven, and they, they said in their journals that the one thing, the two or three things that they would not trade under any conditions was their scientific equipment, their their guns and their black pots. They've been around, Paul Revere is actually the one who invented the little rim around the edge of the pot. So they've had them since the late 1700s, uh, so all through the 1800s and 1900s. So here we are co cooking with an idea that's a couple hundred years old. Oh my goodness. What did you call that? Cinnamon pull apart. Cinnamon pull apart. Yeah, there we go. Man, no. Don't try it. Do you have the recipe on that one? Dad, is it ready? Oh, it's ready. Okay. Yummy. You got spicy baked eggs and regular baked eggs. We only do this four times a year. You know, every season, uh, the four seasons, we're out here during every season and do it. So it's good for camaraderie and just get to know other people and see what they're doing. And This is what makes it fun, it's cleaning it all up. <laughs> it's a lot of fun and the good food was great. So. <laughs> Now we just have to go home and clean up a mess. <laughs> Goodbye! You look like you're cold. I am. <laughs>